we consider a problem from trigonometry that has appeared in a recently conducted joint entrance examination main. The question is from joint entrance examination main held on 20th July 2021 in the morning shift. The question is from the trigonometry. The question is, if in a triangle ABC, the side AB is equal to 5 units, angle B is equal to cos inverse 3 by 5, and the radius of circumcircle is 5 units, then the area of the triangle ABC in square units is, the four options are, given here. We discuss its solution now. Solution. We have a triangle ABC. This is the triangle ABC. Angle A, angle B, angle C. The side opposite to angle A is denoted by small a. Similarly, opposite to angle B is lowercase b opposite to angle c the lowercase c the small a b c will represent the sides of a triangle every triangle has a circum circle that means for any given triangle we can always draw a circum circle this is the center of the circum circle this is the circum circle and the capital r denotes the radius of the circum circle. What are given is listed here. Listed here. P C small c is equal to 5 units. Angle B is equal to cos inverse 3 by 5. We will imply cos B is equal to 3 by 5. Cap claw is equal to 5 units. Having known cos B, I can always find sin B. That is sin b is equal to under the square root of 1 minus cos square b and cos b is 3 by 5. Substituting and simplifying, we get 4 by 5. We have this famous formula capital R is equal to small a by 2 sin a is equal to small b by 2 sin b is equal to small c by 2 sin c is equal to a b c, the product of the sides by 4 delta, where delta is the area of the triangle. Now, capital R is equal to B by 2 sin B, in which I know capital R, we know sin B, I can always find small b. The side B is equal to 2 times R into sin B, 2 into capital R is 5, into sin B is 4 by 5, 5, 5 cancels, 2, 4 are 8. We have side C, 5. Just now we have found side B, 8. Cos B is 3 by 5. And capital R is equal to 5 units. We have this famous formula with us. Now, we know small c, small b, cos b. I can find the side small a using one of the cosine formulas. So, the side a can be found by cosine rule. The cosine rule is cos b is equal to c square plus a square minus b square by 2ac, in which all parameters are known except a. So, substituting, we will get cos b is 3 by 5 is equal to 5 square plus a square minus b square is minus 8 square by 2a into c is 5. Cancel of 5, 5 in the denominators. Send this 2a to the other side, 2a times 3 is 6a, 6a is equal to a square minus 39. Thus, we have got a, a quadratic equation, a square minus 3a minus 69 is equal to 0, and we know how to solve a quadratic equation, and uh, we can find the value, the roots of it, that is a is equal to plus or minus, minus b minus 6 is plus, plus 6 plus or minus under the square root of my b square, that is 6 square, minus 4 into the coefficient of 
a square that is 1 into c minus 39 so that is because of the minus 39 the formula has become plus 4 times 139 1 into 39 and that will be equal to 6 plus r minus under the square root of 36 plus 4 times 39 is 156 by 2 36 plus 156 is 192 under the square root of 192 is equal to 8 root 3 so we get 6 that is equal to 6 plus r minus 8 root 3 by 2 cancelling 2 both numerator and denominator we get 3 plus r minus 4 root 3 thus we got the side a is equal to 3 plus r, 3 plus 4 root 3 and we have rejected 3 minus 4 root 3 because it is negative and a side the length of a side cannot be negative now we know the side a side b side c capital r and we use the formula r is equal to a b c by 4 delta where delta is the area of the triangle is unknown we can find now delta is equal to a b c by 4 r substituting the values a is 3 plus 4 root 3 b is 8 c is 5 by 4 times r 4 into 5 5 5 cancels and 4 twos are 8 2 times 3 plus 4 root 3 is 6 plus 8 root 3 square units let's look at our uh, options the option the four options are here and uh, our answer 6 plus 8 root 3 appears at the option 4 therefore our final answer is option 4 thus we have come to the end of the discussion of the problem and I hope that you have understood the solution of it and uh, the problems from trigonometry you know requires many formulae so prepare a chart of formulae and remember them work out some more problems on these lines from a standard textbook I wish you all the best thank you